Are you using an exercise band to train the muscle up? Well, there's a better way. And in today's video, I'm going to show you exactly what that is. We have an extensive article with detailed tutorial videos on how to get the full muscle up. So be sure to check that out after watching this video link in description. Now, before we get into my preferred method of training the muscle up, let's take a look at the use of bands. There's typically two ways that you can use the band. Now, one of these would be lace the band up over the rings, take the band around you, and then you'll get into your false grip position and work on your transition from there. Another option is if you have a bar that's relatively low like I have here. You can take the band, place it over the top, and then thread the band through itself. And then from here, you're gonna work yourself inside of this band. You're gonna pull it under your butt. You're gonna grab a hold for your false grip. And from here, you can start working on your transitions, going into the muscle up, coming back out of it, and work on that. And this is my main issue with the band, is that when you're using a band, you need to make sure that it is in place. And that actually forces you into a position. Your legs out front, sitting in this position, almost as if you're performing an L-sit, and keeping that position when you're working on the muscle up. The reason why is, anytime I fully extend my body, the strap is gonna come up, hit me in the back. Not optimal. The band is an additional piece of equipment that you have to have with you. And you become reliant upon using that band. By always relying on the band, it actually doesn't allow you to bring the kind of focus and awareness to your body that you could have if you step away from using the band. And being able to bring awareness to your body and know exactly where your body needs to be in space is what's really gonna help you to get the muscle up. Yes, you can use bands, but one of these days you've got to get rid of those bands. So rather than working with the bands in the beginning, let's just get rid of them and not even use that. And instead use something that we can scale, something that we know that we can adjust depending on where we're at that day, something that we can use that's going to continue to help us whether we're working on our first muscle up or multiple repetitions of the muscle up. Now remember that we've got that article along with tutorials on how to get the full muscle up. So be sure to check that out after this video. Now my preferred way of training for the muscle up is by using what I call the baby muscle up. I can honestly say that I've helped thousands of people in getting the muscle up and the baby muscle up is a key component of how I like to do it here in GMB. And the main reason that I love the baby muscle up is that it's so scalable. Whether you still need work on the pull up portion of it, transition, or even working from the top down, all you really need to do is adjust the rings. And that's the beauty of this. This allows you to work on the full muscle up and you can scale it at any place within the movement. This is the difference between using a band and using the baby muscle up. Remember the band forces you into a position that you must keep throughout the duration of the muscle up. Whereas with the baby muscle up, you can adjust depending on what you need at each place in the movement. Using your toes on the ground, possibly only using one leg, then working to raise the rings higher and higher so that when you're performing the movement, you start to strengthen each component of it. And you're doing it still in a safe manner and not rushing it by giving yourself false confidence and only relying on the band. The baby muscle up forces you to become more aware in your body. You'll find that you can adjust the intensity. You might need more intensity. And by doing that, you can maneuver yourself into position that's gonna force you to get stronger, to improve your flexibility and that control. Bands are not inherently bad. And if you like using them, then keep doing it. But thanks to the scalability and the feedback that the Baby Muscle Up provides, I feel that it's a much, much better movement to be focusing on. Be sure to check out our Muscle Up tutorial with all the training plans and details, and let me know what I can do to help you out.